This is the second video lecture on Python. In the previous video lecture, we have already downloaded the Python. So in this video lecture, now I will let you know how to get download an editing tool or an IDLA for Python. So type atom.io. You will be redirected to this particular website. Just a second, my internet is slow. So click on the download button as I have already downloaded the software. I am not going to download it. After downloading it, open Atom. So get on the new file. So first save your file with some name like So dot here dot py is the extension of the python so whenever you save a file with dot py extension it is called a python file so in this video lecture we are, uh, we are going to learn about identifiers and keywords so what are identifiers Identifiers are defined as names in Python. So whenever we declare a particular variable with some name, it is called an identifier like name equal to Sara or num equal to 10, a equal to some 23. So the, here the name num a these are all called as identifiers so let me discuss some rules to define these identifiers so we can use all the alphabets both capital and non capital And we can use numbers. Numbers can be used in between. And we can also use an underscore symbol. Underscore. We cannot use special characters. like dollar at the rate of like, like this one and we cannot use some predefined keywords so what are keywords Keywords are something that which only Python can use and you are not able to use it on for your own self. So Python has the right to use all the keywords for itself and you are not uh, unable to write or you are not unable to use these keywords. So there are total 33 keywords in Python. So we will see what are this keyword what are these 33 keywords. So let me get you a new file. And let me save this as so let us import keyword and 
print keyword dot kw list so here kw list means keyword list so let us save this go to terminal and go to the folder where you have saved this file and type python space the name of the file so these are the keywords that which we cannot use as an identifier in python so like these are false none true and as so these are all the keywords and here there is one more important point that you can note only three keywords have capital letter in the beginning those are true none and false and remaining all have small small letters at the beginning so let us get to the file and let me define some keywords and the hash symbol is called or so or precisely this is used to comment a particular line so what are comments comments are something that the programmer uses to make the code more readable here the pvm python virtual machine does not consider these comments so we won't get an error by using these comments so let us define some of the identifiers name equal to sara name 1 equal to the and some num equal to 10 num2 or num num2 equal to some 23 and we will use underscore even name of employee employee equal to some thing okay so these are all called the identifiers so these are all valid identifiers right also let us define some invalid identifiers to know why you should not use that so one two three name equal to some uh, and dollar dollar name equal to something snap okay let us print these words print name and print name zero one right print number print one two three name print dollar name so let us try to execute this file now type python and the and the name of the file see we are getting an error here one two three name equal to nuts so we'll get rid of that so comment i will comment that and save this file now we will try to run this so we are getting an another error here so since we have used dollar sign it has thrown us an error so i will get rid of this even and save this and we will try to run this file now see sara madhav 10 
all the all those are valid identifiers so let us get to the slides so a name in python is called an identifier as we have discussed example n equal to 2 name equal to sara so these are the rules uh, i have i have given this you can read it so this is an exercise for you to try it yourself comment the answers down in the comment section so these are keywords as i have said there are 33 reserved words or keywords in python so we have done this right so we will we have imported this keyword and uh, we type it keyword dot kw list so we can get all the all the keywords list so what more if you get an error like uh, get me get to that if you get an error there is no module named keyword then then get to the command terminal and type pip install keyword so this is the way we install any module for python so let me get to the terminal and clear this pip install keyboard it's okay we get to that i have bits keywords yes the requirement is already satisfied as i have already installed so let me document that even so this is the end of the lecture guys thank you